Jim. Um, ignore the sub incentive. I couldn't think of one, so it just says ritualistic sacrifice. But we don't mean it at least right now. We might mean it later though. Um, it really depends on if the money rolls in, I guess. <laughs> um, but anyways, Darian, you here? Oh goodness. Cat! Oh my god, thank you for the 18 month resub! Fuck yeah! Skeddy time? No, shut <laughs> I've been here for a while long. This is true! That's uh, that's a uh, fuck 18 months a year and a half, right? Yeah, it's a year and a half. That's crazy. It always feels like yesterday whenever I, I meet people from the stream or just stuff like that. Cause then you, you watch the months climb up and then it's not till it hits like one of these anniversaries till you go, oh my God, that's like a time that I can recognize. That's kind of like, you know, it's kind of like when people are like, oh, my baby is 17 months. No, your baby's just over a year old. Okay, like almost a year and a half at that point. Just, just say that. It complicates things whenever you do that. What? Vex, thank you for converting from a prime sub to a tier one. I don't even know how that works. I don't even know how that works. <laughs> Deadass, I don't know if that's better or worse for me. I have no idea. I don't know what that, I don't know how to quantify that. Um, okay. Uh, but yeah, so we're a couple subs away from that. Dead space still 19 away when it comes to the follows. Uh, definitely tell your friends, and remember, if we at any point in time hit uh, 20 concurrent viewers, I will let you rename the dog from Biscuits to Skeddy. That's the deal we have standing right now, chat. Don't forget it. Um, wait, okay, hang on, hang on. I'm just reading now what you're saying, Darian. Oh my god, so Simply's the one that's hiding. Okay, I thought it was just pictures of Mario 64 and they were doing GeoGuessr. Nope, it was actually really amusing to watch, especially when you watch them lose their minds thinking it's one course when it's not. Oh yeah, I know, I'd lose my fucking mind, are you kidding me? Um... Okay, hang on, let me get situated to go look at the SNES. I am still- oh. Okay, I might have to get up and get some- it depends on how bad my back hurts. If it hurts a lot, I might have to go get some pillows. All right, so let's see. Real question, though. Okay, yeah, it is on here. I didn't know if Biscuits was ever set to work on this screen. I've never tried. Okay, let's go ahead and turn this around. Hang on, let me... Gotta extend the arm here. That way I can still... Jesus. Okay, <laughs> nothing sketchy about that. It doesn't feel like it's gonna fall on me. All right, so we are back on the gym train. We are hopefully going to be getting past level five, which it's funny. I don't, I th it might be the actual fifth level, but it's just called level five. So we'll be getting oh, to actually, that, huh? I, I, I completely missed it because I like passed out last time. You actually finished, uh, it's not a problem. Oh yeah, we finished, not a problem. And then we got to, I had to, I had to look up what it was just level in five. case, but yeah, it's called level five. Um, it's, not, it's not the fifth level, by the way. <laughs> no, yeah, which is funny. I didn't expect it to be. Because, like, in the same thing, I saw that the final the final world's called Buttville. I, I hate that I got that spoiled, but it's also, like, I needed to see where I was because I, uh, I didn't know how I was going to be getting back there yet. Oh, what the heck? Where did it go? I'm trying to pull up your thing here. With the... You know what? I got an idea. I will just... Copy and paste it. You're never getting rid of me. <laughs> Good. If we get enough people to say that soon, we'll build an army. <laughs> All right. So, uh, what do we got? Conversation fueled by Sketty. I guess. I mean, really. You couldn't. We couldn't have picked like a better pasta, like better pasta dish. Like maybe some fettuccine Alfredo. I guess it's all played up's fault, really. Uh, okay. So next level is. Let me just repause so it counts. So, level five contains one heck of a secret, by the way. Okay. Hang on. Okay. A, B, X, A, A, X, B, X, B, X, A, X. Shit, I did it wrong. How did I use the- I held the controller a certain way and it was super easy. Let's see. Okay.
Did it not work? What the fuck? I'm looking at it. There we go. Groovy. 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 Man, as much as I want to just play in Andy Asteroids, I know that I just got to do this for time because we're going to spend so much time on level five, it's not even going to be funny. Oh. That's a food crime and a half. That's not even going out of food, it's going out of memes. But I totally hit it that time. I was so good at inputting this! Don't play a game for one week and this is what happens. There we go. Now we just gotta do that a bunch more times. By the way, I don't know what day I'm gonna do this, but one of these days, I'm gonna dedicate to being a PlayStation day. So, we're gonna be playing a bunch of uh, stuff I hadn't played. Jack, nice Daxter, you know, Ratchet, Clank, uh... <laughs> Uh, Sly. I got the Sly Cooper games. Some of them I have to stream from, like, PlayStation itself, so we'll see how that goes. But my internet might be good enough to pull it off. We'll see. Okay, there we go. I'm getting better at this. Gotta get back into muscle memory. I hate that I figured out that you can make him say groovy by pressing A again. That's like the worst thing I figured out for this entire playthrough. I don't think I can go any faster than that. I think the novelty's worn off. I want to keep trying to break, like, the gym sound barrier, but I don't think it's possible. Ow! Whoops, that's not the right thing. Groovy! I think we have one more skip before level five. Yeah, because you have Snot a Problem next. <laughs> Ew. I hate it. I hate it. It's not a problem. No, it's two brace and then it's not a problem. See, the first two rounds are always easy. It's round three is where, it's, is where it sucks. I gotta remember whenever I get there to give me continues. Well, we're on. Yeah, because like I, I don't want to have to do this whole skipping thing again. I'd like to just tackle it. Especially because I remember immediately whenever I hit, uh, whenever I ended up hitting, oh, what was it? Level five, I was like, oh, this is some fucking bullshit. Like, it's not the worst in the world, but it's definitely a lot harder than the previous level. Oh, man. So, okay, open call for anyone. Is anyone doing anything interesting this weekend, aside from attending CaroCon? I know that a bunch of y'all are. I'm just curious, because, like, obviously when I say y'all doing anything interesting, some of you are going to be like, well, I'm coming to your house this weekend. I know that. Fucking love's not a problem theme. It's... Ugh. 
it's like not bad the songs are really good in this i'll give it that but it's not a problem was so fucking annoying I think it was the third one. The third the third round and the fact you have to do this three times. Oh, the monster at the bottom and the and like the tensile strength of the uh the rope the third time around, it, that made me want to die. Oops, that's not right. Honestly, it's not until you uh go back to moments like this that you really realize, wow, we've been through a lot in this game. Groovy. What? Well, I'm gonna go to the Tipsy Cow. It's an ice cream shop, an alcoholic ice cream shop? What? What? Hello? That's fucking awesome. They do that? Does ice cream get you drunk? Is that a thing that can happen? Because I don't think you can get, like, pissed off of some rum raisin or anything. I like how you said that in passing like it was just a normal thing. I'm gonna go to the alcoholic ice cream bar. I'll see you later. Oh, oh, that's a thing? That's a thing that exists? You're not gonna elaborate on that a little bit? Oh, I would, I would like a... some elaboration. That would be sick. We have a barcade, like, ten minutes Ruby. away. See, that's what I hate about not living... When I lived in Leander, there was this place called, um uh penballs and they had a barcade like 15 minutes from my house and that would have been a place i would have loved to have brought y'all because they had a whole corner for retro stuff and another corner for penball and another corner for like real stuff okay here we are we're back all right all right continues get your continues yes hang on let me get the code for that continues continues extra continue i am gonna be so over this fucking music in like 15 minutes oh yeah it's so grating because the technological limits make this the slowest experience of my life. Y, X, B, Y, oh fuck, this one sucks, okay. I don't know if it's doing anything. I forgot, there's no way to tell. Until you die. I'm just gonna hit it a bunch of times and see what happens. Yeah, level five arguably has one of the worst themes in the game. It's definitely the most generic, 100%. I've heard of that place, and I've wanted to order some of their ice cream, but you can get it shipped to you in a box with dry ice. You can? Okay, that's something that I gotta try at some point. That sounds delicious. Okay. I think I got plenty of those. We'll check after we actually die. Um, okay, I'm turning around. I'm gonna have to use my phone for chat now. Small hole in the wall, though. It's really good. You know, I, I love places like that. And I say this all the time. My favorite Chinese food restaurant has like 3.5 stars in Winter Park, Florida. And it's, uh, it's, it's like, I don't know. It feels really authentic. I, it's either that or it's secretly really gross. I don't know. It's one of the things, but I'm not willing to, uh, I'm not willing to listen to reason because the food is just too good. Okay, hang on. I'm losing a lot of quick and easy health here. So let me. Yeah. You gotta watch out for all the little wormy dudes. They're annoying. I hate those guys so fucking much. Ow! Ow! Stop it! Oh, that's right. I can shoot beneath the platform. I like that they at least give you so much ammo and it regenerates. All right. Ow! The mission is now get health and get the fuck up here. I remember some of this level, but I didn't get. I didn't even get to like the first continue area on this, if memory serves. Yeah, dog. we heard you like platforming, so we're gonna make you do some pretty harsh platforming for your platforming. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, and one of the things people don't realize is that this is done, at least by me specifically, for this playthrough on the Nintendo or the SNES controller. And it is, it is nothing short of rough. Like, it is, it's kind of insane. Because, like, you have a four-way D-pad and eight-way controls, and this particular controller is Milo's from, like, her childhood like her and her families so it needs it needs to be like taken apart it needs a new transmission you know 
like the the, the d-pad's like far from perfect and everything so it creates a lot of uh angles for error especially whenever and thankfully they thought of this and i will give the game dev credit for this whenever you jump and do your whip up you don't have to do up and right which thank goodness because when you're in the air and you do up it automatically says oh you want to go up left or up right because in no situation are you airborne and have to grapple up thank god because i that would have been hellish during that one segment and that is a play on words okay that's how you know it's bad it's got me making puns Oh, oh, there we go. Okay, we got it. Oh god, 2%. Not great. Not great at all. No, okay, zero health because apparently, and I hate that you can't do this. You can't like do a jump over the rope or if you can, I hit the wrong button. Because A is, you know, A and B are your normal suspects, but B drops you from the rope into the icy abyss and that's not fun. Is there, hang on, is there health at the other end of this? Let's see. Come on. There we go. Nope. Ow. Screw those little wiggly wormy thingies. Honestly, though. I think it's one of the worst things in this game just because the rest of the enemies are not bad. I think the worst enemy till now was the Hellhound and then the other actual dog from New Junk City. So anything involving dogs? Well, yeah, but like the Hellhounds were different. I actually liked that the Hellhounds designs went so hard though. I liked them. They were genuinely scary. Like for me as a kid, I would have stopped playing the second I arrived in hell. There we go. I really wish there was a continue. We're talking about La Planeta de Agua. You know, kind of curious, what game series are you looking forward to when you start on the PlayStation stuff? Like, the oh, most looking forward to? Oh, I'm really glad you asked. So, one of the things I've always looked at my entire life and thought that looks like a really neat game because I had no stealth games in my life was Sly Cooper. And I'm genuinely excited. I just hope that the, the streaming it option like works out in you know like a flawless way for us streaming it and streaming it because you can only get three and one and two you have to stream from playstation with the subscription right as you know and um it's you know i just it, it ha i hope it's good enough for a viewing experience because this is gonna be my first time doing sly cooper and i want it to be good because i have always looked at this game and went wow this looks really neat and the branding looked at really cool too i mean you had a mischievous looking raccoon man and a, and a logo that had his like mask of a face on it it went hard the branding went really hard so you know i'm excited to play that i think the most um everyone says ratchet and clank is really good i uh, probably hear about that i was that. about to mention that series so i, I so one a uh, bad news about ratchet and clank it is mostly stream for like games so i hope that also goes well thankfully when it comes to this a lot of these games are uh old enough to where they don't require a lot to do so hopefully streaming them won't be that bad but uh yeah uh, cause like I've heard about Jack and Daxter, but Ratchet and Clank, I think have had a lot more notoriety when it comes to, you know, IPs that I've heard of, especially when it comes to my friends talking about them. Also, I'm so excited about this for Carocon, but we also have Injustice, which is that DC, you know, villains and superheroes fighting game. And I'm really excited to see how good that is. Yippee! Yippee! Glad to see you're getting the hang of, uh, doing midair whips. Yes, oh my god, you saw that. That's only the only thing I can say is I have worked on it and I will never perfect it though. Now for the fun part of this level. One thing I do like about this is that when they hit you with something, it is usually a hundred percent mirrored when they do it again. Cut it out! You love playing Ratchet and Clank. So out of all the ones that you did play, which one was your favorite? Also, hang on. You only really got to play one level of Sly Cooper because there was a cheat code in the demo. Wait. For, oh, there was a... Okay, there's a cheat code for a demo in one of the Ratchet and Clanks. That's funny. Yep, well, yeah, I, believe that that was, I believe that was actually the original Ratchet and Clank that had that demo. Can, can we bring back people doing shit like that where you get a cheat code and suddenly you get like... 
I don't know, either all oh. unlocks if you've already done it, or like, uh, specifically of, fun things like previews. One of the more infamous ones that I remember was Crash 3 Warped and Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage had codes for each other hidden in their, uh, hidden their code. Okay, see, that's what's up, is doing it, like, back-to-back -back like that. <clears throat> Sorry. Um... Ratchet and Clank, Jack and Dexter, Sly Cooper, basically the three big game series on PS2 that aren't God of War. Y you know what? Yes, but I would also posit that Uncharted, uh, another series that I'm looking forward to. My cousins refused to buy an Xbox because Uncharted was not on it. And that is where our gaming difference has begun. You know what I mean? So it, it's one of those things where it's like, if it's good enough for a lot of people uh, to sit there and tell me, oh, hey, <clears throat> Uncharted's pretty good. You should try it. And I saw a little bit of it when I was at... They don't, uh, they're not in chat anymore, but, uh, Amaranth Phantom, whenever I went to their house a couple times, I had, um, I had seen them playing, I think it was four, and it looks fun. I mean, I love narrative-driven games. You can't go wrong with that for me. I as long as the narrative is good. That. I can't believe it either. Five health. Yep, yippee! So, I will tell you here, when you get to the top of the next core of this quarter coming up, yeah. Jump into the jump into the red light in the upper left. When you get to the top of this corridor? When the top of this corridor, upper left hand corner. Okay. So it's it's so it's and you'll see it's a full red light too. It's not like just a small little tiny thing hiding above an orb. <laughs> Tomorrow's Monday, right? Yep. I gotta Professor make monkey for a head. I gotta make a phone call just to to get my paranoia out of the way. Cause so at some point I'd gotten a text that said your appointment was canceled. And I think it was my doctor, but the only things I have to expect are that and the uh, eventual assessment for my potential ADHD. And um and I just want to make sure that that didn't get canceled in any way. And they're like, oh, we'll just wait until the 11th, and you know. Uh, if we don't, if you don't get a call by, then call us. And I'm just like, but what if they canceled it for a reason? And I'm like, not on the list anymore or something. Oh, come on. How did I, I know there's a way. Oh, wait, hold on. That's what it is. We jumped to the left. I thought that spike was a platform, but I don't think it is. Uncharted was Naughty Dog, right? I have no idea. Yeah, I know. It oh, it was. Okay. That's, they yeah. also did Watch Dogs, right? Crash Bandicoot. Oh, Crash Bandicoot. Did they do, wait, hang on. Did they do Watch Dogs? Who did Watch Dogs? Ubisoft? I don't know. I believe Watch Dogs was Ubisoft. That's why they're in um, X Defiant. Oh, that's true. It is Ubisoft. Because I, that's another game that I downloaded. Because everyone, you know, it's funny. When it first came out, nobody really cared about it. And everyone's like, oh, it's not that great. But then now everyone's like, oh, Watch Dogs is Pog. And I'm like, what changed about it? I'm pretty sure the second game is what people are critically acclaiming. But I, I don't know. And if I'm going to play the second one, I might as well play the first one. And I got to check for this. But I want to see if the, any of the Yakuza games that I have so are on there. It's not the red light that's above your head currently. There's another one in the upper left-hand corner of this corridor. Yeah, I'm trying to trying to shoot these eyeballs Ow. Ow, stop it. They're, en they're endless what No, I stubbed my toe on a brain. Don't you just hate it when that happens and you just stub your toe on a randomly placed brain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, me whenever I kick the shit out of us in Baldur's Gate 3. To be fair, you started this section with like 19 health and you lived that long. Yeah, you know what? I was going to say, I think I did pretty good. I think I've gotten a lot better at gun spamming. I think that's, that's one of the things. That's pretty much what the game is about. Oh, yeah, and I hate it. Well, I mean, not hate Get it, out but, of like, here, it's Professor harder. Professor Monkey for a head. Is that what that is? Yeah, that's Professor Monkey for a head. Oh, okay, because I see the monkey bit, and and I guess, because, like, the rest of he just looks like a just a monkey, not like a monkey head guy. Yeah, all the enemies, all the bosses in this game just are weird and have weird names. I mean, considering that the guy made Cat Scratch, I think I expected it. 
Who names a cat Gordon? I mean, then you have Mr. Blick. Yeah, that one also doesn't make any sense, but you know and what? Waffle. But Waffle makes sense. Waffle is 100% like the a kind of name, name you would give a cat. Yeah, that I expect. Uh, Waffle was my favorite, though. I, I, you know, my entire life, I always thought that I was a Waffle, but I am definitely a Gordon when it comes to, like, intellect. That just means Vex is Mr. Blick. You, uh, what, wait, hang on. But, like, but what makes Vex Mr. Blick at that point? Loves loves chaos and just loves making people mad, when, especially when it comes to Siege. <laughs> Secret supervillain. <laughs> Remember, upper left corner, there's that red light. Oh, oh, right, oh, right. Fog, fog. I stopped my swing midway. Ugh, fucking level five. I hate the music in this place. Cannot stress it enough. It's the weakest of the entire soundtrack. Nintendo could not have invested in a slightly better sound chip, maybe for like two extra seconds of audio. Uh, okay, there's a light. I'm, I'm at the light in the top right or top left corner. It's like a series of lights, right? Yeah. You oh, just, yeah. You just jump into it. It's dark. What do I do? Who turned out the lights? Hello. Have fun. Who in here? <laughs> there's menacing eyes. Jim doesn't like that. You say good luck, but you know it's funny. This kind of shit, this kind of gameplay is literally. This used to be in a Maple Story Party quest where you had a bunch of eyes in the dark and you had to platform over invisible platforms. So this is my element, bitch. This is also you playing this game currently, just white wow. as fuck. <laughs> Exit, baby! Oh, there's a life! Oh, how do I reach that? Oh, well. Wait. Oh. It's not the exit. It's just the way towards the exit, if I had to guess. Yeah, a lot of people missed this on their first playthroughs of this game. Missed what? For obvious reasons. Who turned out the lights? Oh, it's- oh, yeah, you know what? I could see that. It's got secret level vibes as fuck. Oh, you gotta keep going? Alright. And you can't go to- But the music's also better than level 5 by a long shot. I don't know why, but it gives me Mario vibes. Oh, that- those fucking bitches. The changing in the lighting made me think that it was, like, something I had to interact with. There we go. Well, kinda. Ooh, an extra life again. Wait. Damn it. Of course it's not that easy. No, damn it. I wanted that life. There's two lives that I've passed up now, and I hate that. What is, what is that sparkly? Oh, it's a hook. What? We have learned. Do I have to do a double hook in the dark? I don't see another sparkly. You're gonna lurk? Alrighty, have a good lurk, Nova. It's not a monkey head guy. It's a guy with a whole monkey for a head. Oh! Interesting. Wonder what fucking drug he was on for that one. Oh, there is the, there's the second one. I fucking knew it. I knew it. You fucking bitch.
Let's go. And we still are in the dark. How? You know, double, sw d double swings, though, are something that's a really hard skill to learn, so getting that down. We did it in less than five minutes. I mean, I'm pretty proud of that. Mm -hmm. Ow. Ow. Damn it. This better be over soon, because I am whittling away my health. That's a big pair of eyes. What the fuck? How am I supposed to compete with that? <laughs> Where did I start? Is this the room before? It should start in the room you started in. Started in? Yeah, it should, so you should be in the fifth area. So I should be in front of the boss? Yeah. Okay. What, does it just one hit you? That. Oh yeah. <laughs> so, your best bet is to flee and then jump over him. What? I didn't think that was an option. It's pitch fucking black. <laughs> am I, so, so now that I'm dead, am I next to the boss again or where the fuck am I? You should be back in area one, I'm pretty sure. Area one? Fuck me. I um, mean, if, if you see lights within the first, like, couple seconds, then you're in area one. If oh, not, not, you're in area five. Okay, I'm in area five. Thank God. God <laughs> bless the continues. Damn! I'm, I'm so sad. I'm hoping I'll get to it. Uh, we're gonna get to it tomorrow. Oh, shit. Okay, run. Okay, but how am I gonna jump over this bitch? Oh, Jesus, fuck. No! How am I supposed to get over this thing? What, can, can I light a candle? Something like that? Nope, you just gotta remember your pathway to get- You gotta remember your pathway. Damn it. Ow. Oh my god, run! RUN, JIM! Haha, <laughs> let's go. And you've completed who turned out the lights. Nice job. Hooray, I feel a sense of non-accomplishment for some reason. <laughs> I'm kind of sad that it didn't even give me like an extra life or nothing. It was just literally me being dark and scared. I am glad I got to see it though. Those fucking eyes were absolutely terrifying. Oh yeah, no, that probably scared many a person who's played this game. Younger me would not have been a fan. Younger me would have been like, why would I go there? What the fuck? Oh my god, I hate these little brain frogs so much. <laughs> Make me want to play Sudoku, am I right? Oh fuck. Oh, by the way, we hadn't really talked about this, but I had found my cards against humanity while we were cleaning. Don't know if anyone has booster boxes. So I know that I know Vex wanted to play cards against humanity. I love cards against humanity. It's great. I just I wish the novelty didn't wear off so quick. Oh shit, Jerry! Oh my goodness! Thank you for the six, 61 month resub! I know we already talked about the, the fucking 60 before. Oh my god, what was that? What was that? What was that noise? That was so weird. Okay, I guess it was nothing. But yeah, thank you, Jerry. Hope you're doing great today. We're doing some uh, Earthworm Gym. Hopefully finishing the game, I hope. I don't know how long the game is really, but as long as we get past level five, I'll feel some sense of accomplishment. I think you only think, I think you only have two levels left after this. Ooh, I hope we can finish it. This would be so good because today's our last gym day. And then Vex gets to, I, th I think Vex just wants board games for the next month.
I'm hyped about the news you gave. Oh my gosh, yeah. So I don't know which day it's gonna be when it comes to like per week, but I will be dedicating a day a week to playing Sony IPs since I have to make this uh, $17.99 plus tax subscription uh, uh, worth it <laughs> on a monthly basis. I hate this part. But yep, not sure which one I'm gonna start with. I'm either gonna start with Kingdom Hearts or Sly. Kingdom Cause Hearts! Because I've been pretty excited to start Sly, but like I know that I know that a bunch of people would probably die for a completely blind take on Kingdom Hearts in 2024. Cause like I know that if I was a fan, I would think that's insane. Disney, Disney, these nuts. But it's kinda like um since I you know I played Maple Story for so long. Now that Milo plays, I just, I'm always constantly spouting off about how the game used to be and different things about the lore and shit. Note to self, do not touch any of those. Yippee! Yippee! I'm just a worm, man. Life is a nightmare. Yippee. I just don't feel like myself when I'm out of the suit. <laughs> oh, fuck. They just. Okay, good. I'm glad I didn't lose any health on that. I was like, did they just throw me into a grenade? That's not cool, man. Funny enough, that was one of those little wiggly worm creatures. Oh, it was? Mm -hmm. I didn't even notice. So you just auto annihilated it. Nice. <laughs> That's definitely one way to think about Kingdom Hearts. And I actually love that take. Hang on, let me read. Oh, geez. Here's an honest take. It's complete crap, but I love it. <laughs> and any real Kingdom Hearts fan will tell you the same. <laughs> I love that that's I love that that's how you feel. The issue with Kingdom Hearts is that you need to play all the games. Kingdom Hearts 3 will not make sense without them. Of course, no, you know me. I want to whenever I get into a series, I like to absorb all the the universe. It's one of the reasons why it's one of those reasons why I'm like, you know, apprehensive to get it like when we did Donkin Rampa you know how we did all the Donkin Rampa like sequentially is because I was able to absorb it and still forget a lot of the details because my brain for some reason does not work but we're getting that looked at by a specialist which is pog spin-offs aren't optional that's fine what was it I wanted to play I remember playing uh oh god which one was the Game Boy Advanced one with the card-based combat? Because I remember fucking Aid running... Of memories. That was my first time with card-based uh, combat, and I remember running out of cards when I was playing, I think, Riku? Maybe? I don't remember. I was playing my friend's copy, and I ran out of cards, and I was like, how are you supposed to beat this guy? And I was only playing because my friend couldn't get past the boss. So, like, how the fuck was I supposed to, right? Oh, yeah. And, and so, Chain um, yeah. Chain of Memories was actually so good, they actually made a PS2 version of it. It's the second game? Mm -hmm. Okay, I wonder... I was about to say you got to Riku, not me, my friend. <laughs> RE Chain of Memories is the PlayStation 2 version. Okay, well, we'll have to see what I can get, because I have the three you can get on PlayStation, which is, they have fucked titles. I'd have to show it to you. Jerry knows them, but it's like... Apparently the first one on the list is six games, and I was like, oh. <laughs> that's, that's a lot of games. Also explains the file size. Um, I, which by the way, I'm downloading games right now with the PS5, so I don't think there's been any net instability. I think the net's thankfully better than that, but if, if it does fuck with anything, I'll have to turn it off later. It's downloading. I think I've downloaded, I don't know what it's at now, but as of last night, it was 300 gigabytes of games and it's a 600 gigabyte drive. So I'm trying to fill it up with games, play the games, empty the games, and then fill it up with more games. That's the, that's what we're going to do. And it's going to be so much fucking goddamn fun, and I'm so excited. And I can't thank Glob enough, because I have never thought that I would get, uh, I never thought I would get a chance to experience most of the Sony titles, but knowing that for a little bit every month I could do as much as I want to, um, I mean, that's pretty sick. Definitely helps fulfill my gaming needs in that particular situation, as opposed to getting a bunch of games just paying for them. And then, ooh, I found this out. 
Apparently you can just buy any PS4 game and shove it in the disc tray. Pog, I can't wait because PS4 games are so inexpensive at game exchange. <laughs> like, I can't wait to see what I can get. I'll come home with like, I'll be like, hey guys, I spent 20 bucks and got a hundred goddamn games. No one's buying it. Well, maybe now, but they definitely weren't. I don't think I've ever seen any of the shelves get smaller. I hate that I have to pause because like I would just sit still and read chat, but if I don't pause, everything moves. Okay, there conveyor we go. Conveyor belts. Yeah, fucking conveyor belts. 1.5, 2.5, chain of memories. Oh, Jesus Christ. And a couple of movies. See, I like the idea of there being a movie or two or whatever in there just because like that, that's fun. I don't know. I like, it's kind of like the Danganronpa anime. It really just expanded the universe. And I think that it's nothing but like a, you know, it's something that I think a lot of and of course, a lot of shows and kids' properties consider it by making video games and stuff into yeah. shows. You yeah, know. 358 slash 2 days is the one game they actually turned into a movie. That's crazy. Well, I mean, so is so did they turn it into a movie because there was just so much cutscene compared to gameplay? Is that what was going on? Okay, why can't I get to the... I'm trying to get to the whip right there, but I keep falling. I'm not sure if you can whip directly from hanging, but... No, you can't. Or you can just jump and try to avoid the hanging thing. Oh, you know just... what? That's probably gonna be what we have to do. I think that's... Fuck, I think that's what I did last time. Oh. Oh, there's health down here? That's sick. I didn't even know. Health? Free brain? Why haven't I been here before? Nope. Okay. Uh, damn. Okay, hang on, hang on. Off to catch up again. It's really funny. Didn't realize until we touched the subject how uh, how much everyone knew about Kingdom Hearts. Um. Uh, okay. By movies, he means just cutscenes uh Oh, okay. Cutscenes of a game you can't play. So yeah, it is, okay, so it's cutscenes just shoved together. I mean, I wish, you kind of hope that it would be like something made on its own. You know what I mean? Like I said, cause like the anime with Danganronpa is at least like an anime. You think they would have at least gone with like something independently good. It's weird, a weird choice to do it, but if they recognize that their game is mostly cutscenes, I mean, I guess why not? You recommend emulating them? Uh, okay, so... I'd have to... I'd have to find the emulator. I'd have to maybe... I'd have to figure out the emulation for that, because I don't keep... I think the only emulator I have on my computer is... Dolphin, but I don't have any games. Because, you know, I try to do things legit, hence the pausing of the, the SNES, right? So, um... But yeah, like, when we get to Kingdom Hearts and start playing through them, definitely give me tips on how to get the best experience. Because, like, I don't mind watching cutscenes as a movie, but when it comes to gameplay, I mean, I would rather, if there is a game to play, play the game. Especially because, I don't know, as someone who hasn't played this kind of stuff before, I don't want to say that I could potentially, you know, give some kind of different take on it, really, but at least it would I would have some insight from someone who's never played the series and also... Never really spent time uh, playing a lot of games that you could classify as cutscenes or movies. So it'll be a real experience for me. We'll see how that goes. But considering I like Halo a lot, I don't think I can go that badly. Because I fucking, I fucking love Halo. Halo's like, Halo's like one of my favorite game franchises. And even they, like, Easy will agree with you if he was here. Um, that the the cutscenes in Halo definitely, towards the like later games, gets really fucking long. I remember at one point... We were up late playing Halo. I forgot which game. I think it was two because they redid the cutscenes. And I nearly fell asleep during one because it was like 20 minutes long or more. I don't even, I wasn't timing it, you know? And uh, I don't mind it in most cases, but also, you know, there is a situation in which I imagine that's why you want to play the game because it's the so long to the point where you're like, hey, you need the gameplay to break up the monotony. At least that's my biggest guess. Ooh, okay. Glad we didn't take damage from that. No, no. 
I think this is the farthest we've ever made it. Get back, Mr. Monkey Man. Is he taking damage from my gun? I can't tell. I'm pretty sure you just have to get through him and get to the end. Oh yeah, check it out. Shh, stupid guy. Oh shit, he's back, he's back. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. What? How am I supposed to... You gotta do a round the corner jump. Can you do that? Oh, you can. Okay. Huh. Oh, shit. Corner jumping just like Sensei Darian taught me. Oh, shit. No, no. We're just gonna go through. It's running time, baby. Oh, shit. Nope. Fuck. Yeah, that's... Funny enough, that's the I'm pretty sure that's the last section of the level, and it's so hard. The only game you can't play anymore is the first mobile game. You'll have to watch cutscenes for that. Okay. Also, who makes a gotcha mobile game canon? <laughs> that's true. Who does that? And then they gambled for about 28 million years to get all of the triple S rarity skins before moving on to the final area of the story. Blueberry, blueberry, blueberry. You can't forget the nice gambling arc of most stories. <laughs> and I remember when Atla did that, it was so great and got addicted to opium and just started spending slots left and right. Made the it really made the series realistic, which is why people liked Korra so much. It'll take place with the other two mobile games in the timeline. So okay, hang on. So and you could still play the other mobile games? How how is that gonna work? Are we just gonna watch cutscenes for those? Cause I don't know if I want to I don't know if I can do mobile games. I've never tried. I've never tried to stream a mobile game. Although it would be cool if we could, because then I could stream Duolingo. Okay. Let me get back into this. Yeah, yeah. See, that's, you know what? At the end of the day, that's what I want. And I hope that, uh, and I don't mind if you guys, you know, push me towards that when we do it, because I would like to, at the end of the day, get as much detail as possible. You know, I would, and you know me, I don't like to do, like, you know, pain, you know, it can be fun. You know, like doing Hollow Knight was kind of painful and fun. But in some cases, if it's just like, it's not even like, like fun to watch someone go through, it's just kind of boring, then like, yeah, yeah, spare me that detail. Spare me the details. Yeah, no, seriously. It's like, I, you know, pulling, pulling gotchas. I'm familiar with that. Chronic Maple Story Addict. We're good. It's fine. I know exactly what, I know exactly what gotcha is, and I'm trying to avoid it for the rest of my life. That's why one of those, uh, some of the times when people are like, you ever play Honkai Star, uh, Star Rail or, uh, uh, okay, Genshin? Star, Star Whale. You want to play Star Whale or Genshin Impact? But yeah, and so I'm just like... I know, and they're like, oh, you should, and I'm just, respectfully, no, I will not. Not saying they're not good games, like, I still play MapleStory, which makes me, you know, the absolute royalty of hypocrites, but it's one of those things where I just don't, I don't need another one. It's kind of why I can't develop a card game habit, because if I develop a card game habit, it is over for me financially. I can't afford that. I can't afford a card game habit. Are you f in this economy? Are you shitting me? Oh gosh, back still hurt pretty bad. Oh, my back. There's fan-made voice-acted versions of all the cutscenes of, oh, okay, of the mobile game. All right. You know what? I got an idea. When we when we start doing it, let's put together like a game plan. We'll like I'll have like a chat with you guys in it, and we'll make a Kingdom Hearts game plan of how to proceed so I can get the true to form Kingdom Hearts experience 
in in y'all's eyes because obviously it's gonna differ from what a timeline or something would say that way that way i don't that way i can do it the right way or like the way that people would think is like the best way to, to take in the series is uh someone who maybe i i i owned anywhere from one to four of the manga i just can't remember because i had i had manga but i don't know what the manga was and and i might have had more i might have had like some naruto stuff as well i don't remember because like i was so young and my mom got rid of it very quickly whenever i ended up like getting to i guess college is when we got rid of all that but i never like once they got to the shelf they never got off the shelf i didn't read you know, I might have read them at the time, but I don't remember anything about it. I remember, I talked to Jerry, I remembered, and I, I called it salt ice cream, which I was close. It's sea salt ice cream, apparently. Mm hmm Which sounds disgusting. So we'll see how that goes. It's surprisingly very good. See, but like, have you had it? Yes, actually. Oh, okay, because I was waiting for you to be like, no, and I was gonna be like, then how do you know? <laughs> but yeah, um, see, that would be, oh my gosh, wait. Oh, I wish Vex was here. I don't know if Vex is, is what's it called? I don't know if Vex is skilled in the arts of creamy creation crafting. I will be right back. Okay. But yeah, so I ten I know somewhat about that, and aside from that, and the fact that there's Mickey motherfucking Moups in this game, that that's all I know. Which I always thought was weird. I was like, so it's anime characters and Mickey. But why? <laughs> but why is Mickey Mouse? <laughs> Also, fuck, I, I don't know, but okay, okay, this is just, this is just something I might remember too, but, so Mickey's in the game, and, and, let me know if I'm right, he's a healer, right? And if he is, why? Why is he a healer? How does that make sense in, uh, I can't wait to find out, there's so many questions I want answered, cause like, Goofy has to be in this universe too. He's a king? Not a healer. Okay, I thought he was a healer. Like, I thought, I thought personally, that he, I didn't want to say the word cleric, because I didn't want to sound too stupid. But a king? Mr. Mr. King Mouse of the Disney, of the Disney Kingdom. I hope I can get to the yippee soon. I want to be done with level 5 so bad. I don't want to give extra lives. I want to believe that I can beat, you know, this in the, like the three lives that they give you, which is how we've been playing this game if anyone's been trying to get like a realm of consistency here. Um, I'm trying to make it through every level in series of levels in three lives. A series, when I say that, being it's not a problem. Uh, well, no, because I didn't do that in just three lives. I think I did each segment? No. I think I did each segment in three. Yeah, because fucking part three was hell. So we're obviously not doing... What's it called? We're obviously not doing, like, every... Three deaths you start from the beginning. I know that they expect you to get, like, continues and stuff, but we have not gotten enough to, like, have any continues without getting them. And, like, extra lives are pretty hard to come by. And so for the sake of actually finishing the game, that's what we've done. I was like, I want to see more of the game, and uh, at the end of the day, the SNES doesn't even have enough long-term memory to really give a shit if you've beaten it all at once or not. You either beat it or you didn't, and by the time you reset the console, it's like, who are you? Yippee! Yippee! Fuck yeah! Oh god, I hate this bit. Okay. Goofy is the head of his guard? Goofy in the military? No, stop it. Fucking hate this bit so much. Oh my god, I lived. Hopefully they dragged me through health. Funny how you keep skipping the things I say. No, I'm so sorry. I'm just reading it off my phone. It's super scuffed.
we have her play release time or canon timeline order? Okay. So, I'm actually curious about this as well. Hold on. Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, Kingdom Hearts 2, Days. I don't know what BBS stands for. Recoded, DDD, O2, UX, oh my god. Back cover, KH3. What is mom? Dark Road. What's the list in order? So, based off of when they came out instead of timeline. Got it. Okay, he's the king, not the healer. He's a king. Donald is the healer, but he spends 90% of the combat wasting his magic or dead. So, Don so Donald's the cleric. Also, is that like a meme? Is just he's always dead? That's gonna be fucked. Okay, Goofy's the head of his guard and Donald is the royal magician. Half of the time he's not referred to as Mickey, just the king. Oh, rough. I'm sure that's exactly how Disney would prefer it. The funny part is when I called Kingdom Hearts a shitty fan fiction. It wasn't even returning to the Disney shit. That's just the cherry on top. What do you mean? So like the anime bullshit has its own layer of dumb shit? Milo laughed from the other room. Why is Milo laughing from the other room? Oh my God. But yeah, anyways, uh, Melody of Memories. Melody of Memories, that's not the rhythm game, right? I'm not gonna have to play the rhythm game. Like, I don't wanna be a hater, but I, I watched Jerry play it for a little bit and it just looked a little bit bland for a rhythm game. Cause I like rhythm games. Melody of Memory, yes, it's the rhythm game. Fuck, oh my God, yeah. So by the way, I I'm gonna go ahead and uh, say this really quick. I do apologize uh, if I read things out of order or skip anything. I'm reading chat from my phone cause the SNES is 90 degrees to the right of my computer. So like, that's, that's, that's one of the reasons why I'm not using my normal chat reading method. And I do apologize. I'm sorry. It's not on purpose. How much have you played of Kingdom Hearts, honey? You played, t you, wait, so you just played, let me guess, you just played one and two? That's it? Did you hear me read out how many games? No, I just, hang on, hang on, hang on. I will read it out again. There's way more than five games. <laughs> Fuck, okay, I'm gonna- Shit, 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 I'm fucking up. Damn, okay, I fucked that up so badly. Donald Duck is canonically ex-Navy?! Donald Duck served in the military?! <laughs> That's so weird! Wait, oh wait, you're right, that is canon for normal. That's still so weird! <laughs> What the fuck? Not in the game? I, th th well, technically, if it's canon, then yes, in the game. That's that's still insane to me, but I always forget that they're old enough to be like World War II era sometimes. Okay, 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 hang on, Milo. I'm gonna go ahead and read you all the games. Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, Kingdom Hearts 2, Whatever Days Means, BBS, Recoded, DDD, O2, UX, uh, which is the mobile game, but we're gonna apparently figure that one out. Uh, back cover, Kingdom Hearts 3, Melody of Memories, and whatever Dark Road is. That's a lot. I didn't even count, but that's a lot. I think we have Chain of Memories now, but we have No, well, you know what? We don't, because all the Game Boy games are right there. If we had the box for that, that'd be crazy. She had to have, because like I said, all the Game Boy games are over there. That's all the games. Um, and then, what was it? No, it's a Game Boy Advance game. Yeah, it is. Because I said, which one's on the Game Boy Advance game? And then they said, Calm, which is Chain of Memories. Okay, hang on. Help us with the debate. Is Chain of Memories a J Game Boy Advance game or a DS game? I, I remember Chain of Memories being... Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm gonna go check that pile just in case. Game Boy Advance? Yeah, I was right. Um, Dark Road is another mobile game. Oh, and Missing Link is a third mobile game. God damn. Coded was DS. Oh, if I can get a copy of that, I can actually stream that. Like, legitly.
Let me let me check to see what is in this pile over here. Because now that my I think it's just Kirby and the Amazing Mirror is what I'm thinking I'm remembering. But there might be a random there might be a random com or uh, Kingdom Hearts game in there. We got one and two for the PlayStation Two, which is Pog. But might as well play the ones for the five. Okay, by the way, so so while, so while I was up looking at it, the game that I thought might have been it was actually a, a Game Boy Advance game of Shaman King, if anyone remembers that fucking anime. They remade it? Was it even any good? I haven't even heard about it. Well, it's good. At least they're doing that. Okay, honey, I love you. That covers the CGI movie. You know, with a name like that, I guess I kind of expected it to be. Is Darian still BRB? No. Oh, okay. For the last two minutes. Oh, okay. I was just like, what happened to you? I went to get noms. I was oh. That's so valid. You so real popcorn, for that. lemon cookies, and a water later on here. Oh, snap. Shoji! Thank you for the 47 month resub. Oh my God. I'm gonna go to bed, but I wanted to stop by and say have a good stream and I hope everyone's having a good night. Yes, thank you. I'm gonna go to bed, but I want to stop by and say have a good stream and everyone here has a good night. I always forgot, I always forget that the TTS will read it. But yeah, thank you, Shoji. And I hope you're having a good night too. We're just uh, hanging out, playing some gym, talking about Kingdom Hearts because it is now on my list of games that I can play. Please give me the shiny red rock this time. Yippee! Yippee! I, okay, it is. I don't know if it's the same route every time, but I think it is. Okay, I don't know which side it's going to start from. I think it starts from the right. It starts from the left. Okay, there we go. Nailed that. 2.8 to start the PlayStation plus 20 bucks up. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yes, that's how I got all the games. Yes, the PlayStation plus platinum. Because like, because like, you know, it's one of those things where I looked at everything I wanted to play and then was like, I bet you I could probably play all these games cheaper than they retail for with the monthly plan. And now it's a challenge. And y'all are going to be with there for y'all are going to be there for me on that adventure with me there. Fuck, I'm really good at talking right now. Platforming got my brain looking like a fucking can of spam. Now the question is, do you want to continue on the route of continue, start level over, and go, or do you want to get the extra life code out? <sighs> Hit me with a Darian. I do, I would like to finish the game tonight, ideally, of course, but not everywhere is an ideal world, sadly. I'll throw a bolt of these your way, it makes it easy. Yay! Yippee! Sorry, I mean, yippee! <laughs>
Then fuck, fuck you, fuck you, worm. There we go. Oh yeah, the energy refill maybe. Definitely maybe for bosses. I could see that being the case. Oh goodness. Let me see if I can catch up with everyone saying here. That's some very famous hard content. Oh boy. All optional. Okay, good, good. Well, well, we'll maybe try those, at least to see how badly they kick me in the teeth, but uh, thank goodness I'm not dedicating to that. Because, like, notoriously hard stuff can be fun, but it can also be completely soul-rending, depending on how you do it. Yeah, well, you know what? We'll have to give it a shot. I mean, especially, uh, especially for like the really notorious stuff. Like, at least give it a shot to see how badly it kicks my ass. It'd be really funny if these like really hard things I like, cleaned it on the first time. That'd be hilarious. Hidden health bar. Oh, oh, fuck that! Oh my gosh, that sucks. <laughs> okay, at least we get the yippee every time we get a life with this. Yippee! Yippee! Oh, you have to unpause it to get the lives. Okay. Should I just yippee my way up to like, I don't know, 10? Probably. That is up to you. I'll probably just do that. We've been on this for long enough. I want to get through this. I want to at least get to the next level. Yippee! 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 Oh good, you can do it multiple inputs, that's good. Oh, you can only- okay, it counts up to nine, so doing above nine might not even be worth it. <sighs> you did not just say 17 HP bars. Holy sh- holy shit. And I thought bosses in Maple Story had a lot of HP bars sometimes. 17? Please tell me that's some kind of technicality and he's got like eight, but there's just a bunch of armor or something. That's like, that's crazy. 17? Oh, well, let me tell you, the battle that I just posted to the chat took me 12 hours over the course of three days to clear. Yippee! Shit. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh gosh. My gym suit! My gym suit! Huh. Oh no! Okay, we're good. I didn't realize there was more conveyor belts. 17,000 health. Oh, jeez. And you said the one you posted yeah. 30 million HP. You know and what? Please note, please note your damage caps at 10,000. Uh, 10, okay, see, that's what I was wondering because that's that matters a lot when it comes to uh, things like that. Because, like, Maple Story, some of the bosses will have trillions of health, but you do billions of damage. Oh, so it it's gets like, worse. you know. Boss ca the boss caps your damage at 5,000 at a certain point in the fight. Oh, fuck off. 
And even worse than that, he actually can cast a spell on you that reflects an all heal spell back at him. Did did I just I think I just got sent back up to the top. Yeah. That's so cool. I love that. I love that a lot, actually. Yeah, there's there have been reports of people who have broke their copies of the game because the boss cast renew on the party who had reflect on, so he gets all 15 million of his health back. Oh fuck that! I'd break it too. So I have to get across this gap. Okay, so we just have to keep going. There is another um, uh, full health thing back on that first conveyor belt. Uh, a second one. Yeah, there's a second one. There are two. Oh, it's I see it. Closer. I see it. Yeah. Thank you. But now I gotta say, when it comes to the diversity of the games we played this year, this is probably gonna be the most diverse year for games we've had, probably for my entire streaming like time. Because I mean, you know, before we just had computer games, but now we have. SNES, 64, GameCube, Wii, Wii U, Switch, all of, like most of the PlayStations because the PlayStation 2 is backwards compat with PS1 because it's a fat one. So PS1, 2, 4, <laughs> the fatty 5. Can do the backwards compatibility. And then, yeah, and then, uh, and then, what was it? And the only thing we're really missing is some of the three games that aren't on PS5 because obviously PS2 can't play P uh, PS3 games. That's like the biggest thing we're missing at the moment. But yeah, and then the PS2, I don't have a hookup for it yet, but I gotta get something that does the, you know, like the HD component cables, like the blue and green ones. I gotta find something that like plugs that into the TV and does some minor upscaling because the only one I have only does yellow and red and white. I think I've seared off the part of my brain that's receptive to sound because it just occurred to me that the same music is still playing. Yeah, but at least you are back to the final area. Oh, I didn't know it was the final area. That mm -hmm. gives me this some... The... Huh? Yeah, this is the final area of level 5. You just gotta get through it. And this gives me the hopium. Damage boost! Damage boost! Oh, I should have taken that. Okay. Damage boost. Go through it, get more health than you had, and run! Remember, the code does include- the codes I gave you do also include an energy refill just in case. Yeah, which- I thought it regened over time. Does it not? I don't think so. I think it's just a, uh, you just have to wait for it to fill up. No, oh, I was just about to be out. Okay, you know what? Can somebody answer this for me? What is platinuming a game when you do PlayStation shit? Electing all trophies. So that's like 100%ing a game? Basically, yeah. That's crazy. Because, like, I, I had assumed it was something along those, but I was like, so what? Because I'd only ever heard of Platinuming, so I was like, so what's the normal achievement system? Is it, like, gold, silver? Like, what? what? Yeah, gold, silver, and bronzes. Really? Okay. I mean, you know, that it kind of figures with that, but Platinum, that's crazy. I yeah. like, you know what it is? I like that because one of, it's one of those things that's different with uh, different kinds of consoles. Like, obviously, you 100% a game on an Xbox. You just have all the achievements and get the max amount of gamer score, right? But I do like the idea of getting, um, what's it called? I do like the idea of getting, like, an actual, like, title for that. Because, like, it's nice. It's kind of like Steam, you know, if you get it, uh, it's called a perfect game in that particular situation. And it feels nice. It's like, oh, we got it perfected. It's like a step above 100%ing. It has a title to it, and it feels nice.
It's got the same ring as Fall in Modern Warfare 2. So, energy refill isn't health, right? Energy refill is health. Oh, fuck me. Okay, I'm doing it. <laughs> I thought energy refill was gun. I kind of wonder why you're going backwards in the level, though. I don't know where I am. I love how Cloud just pointed the same thing out, too. <laughs> it's going left, down, and around. See, well, so I went backwards because uh, I went to the one of the areas that was blocked off, so I needed to get somewhere because the, the, the exit's at the bottom right. The exit's at the bottom right. That's where I'm trying to go. Okay, I don't think I'm doing it right. Huh. I'm definitely putting it in right. N plus X, B, A, B, B, X plus Y, B, A. Yeah, I'm doing that. That's crazy. Yeah, that's the exact code that should be. That's so weird that it's not working, because... We got... AX... B A B B X Y B A. Hmm. Wow. Oh, there it is. It just took a second. And there's no noise that it makes whenever you do it. Oh, so it's uh, that kind of thing where it refills your energy, but it doesn't show you until you, like, take a hit or something. Yep. Oh, okay, let's go ahead and just do that again. That's so funny. I doubt y'all can hear it, but Mia has recently, uh... Mia has recently figured out that she can get Milo to give her tuna if she screams. Oh. Yeah, she's recently figured it. So she's been in the kitchen meowing all fucking day. Yippee! Really glad we just got that continue. Hooray. That part would have probably taken me quite a few tries with no, with no health. Oh shit, it's a fucking boss. Nice car. No, stop it. Let me over him. I don't think I'm doing any damage to this guy. There's a target up above. You gotta drop some on him. Oh. Shit. I'm gonna die the first time. Wait. Do I have to hit it with my head? Whip it. Oh, you have whip to whip it? it? Okay. Love cats. Yeah, Mia's a sweet little baby, but she's just really pulling all the strings she can pull right now. She's over here like, you gave me tuna before, why can't we have it now? And I'm just like, you are never this bad about this. Like, I've had her for 17 fucking years. She's never been this bad. Oh, did I fucking clean his abs? Like, his fucking. Oh no! Oh no! Round two, now you can just shoot him.
Oh, did I get it? Let's go! That's groovy, baby! Level 5 complete. My smudge does the same thing. She's a fuzzy brat and I love her. Yeah, that's... that's... I think that's the best way to describe all the good cats. Spoiled. Bratty. You think you can outdo me? You think you can outdo me? I am the Andy Asteroids Champion! Somebody ported Five Nights to the N64, that's funny. Oh, that's funny. I, I bet you it's actually a lot better. <laughs> Wait, is it just like the same game? Wait, it's the oh my- exact same game. I just died on Andy Asteroids because it had like 10 health. Yeah, hitting the Asteroids does kill- it does kill your health, unfortunately. Whoa, Nelly. I thought that's what he was saying. Shit, I missed the boost. No. No, you bastard. Get back here. You get back here. <laughs> no, he took my fucking... No, he took the boost. Dex is being haunted by the meth ghost. No questions. Please continue. Uh, I hope Vex... Hang on. Let me roll my... Let me roll my reply dice. I hope Vex... Dies. Sorry. <laughs> Vex rolled the... Vex rolled the five. Sorry, Vex. Wanted you to get away. Dice didn't want you to get away. Better than the Scatty Spectre. Shut up. Shut up. The Scatty Spectre. You better watch out. I'm gonna make some Italian American remarks at you. All right. By the way, if, it's, if it looks like I'm not dodging, it's because I'm not, and I want to redo him at Andy Asteroids. Or just kill him. Whichever one comes first. Because I know that I am the best Andy asteroids -er in the- Oh my god, I don't get to go back to Andy Asteroids. <gasps> Devastated! Yep, nope, you're stuck with Psycho until you Fuck. 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 Unless you want to level skip. Fuck. Unless I want to level I mean... <clears throat> I mean, yeah. <laughs> I've already fought Side Crow. I don't need to do it again. These were cheaper. I get Oh, shit. Right. Nope, messed that up. And now on to probably what is the most frustrating level in this game. Oh, and I don't, and I definitely don't mean that as an understatement. For Pete's sake. Yep. Don't know who Pete or his sake is, but he better be How ready. How do you feel about escort missions? No, not in this. Better get those extra life codes ready. Gotta help Jim protect his best friend. Perfect. Oh yeah, let's also stack up on some of these. All right. 
We're good. You're on the mouse. You're on the map with the meth house. You and Nova got stabbed by a guy with a knife, and Vex is searching for him. We're pretty sure it's a ghost. Oh, because he's just not there. Well, you know, I mean, it could be one of those things. What if it was me, and this is my alibi? You'll never fucking know. <laughs> Sir, step away from the child. I am escorting this poor boy to scouts. What the? Oh God, what the fuck? What the fuck is this? Gotta give, gotta give him the whip to get him over the pit. Dude gets pricked on a fucking needle and hulks out because he's addicted to drugs now? Yep, and now you know why this level is one of the more frustrating ones in the game. Maybe to a normal person, Darian. But I know how to whip children. Wait, never mind. Alright, calm down, Ringling and John. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Wait, did send it? Were there some allegations that I'm not aware of? No, remember, there was a song for your favorite Martian called Whip Your Kids. Oh, God, honestly, I forgot because your favorite Martian was just fucking awful. Like, not musically, but just lyrically, it sucked. Why am I getting hit by all this spagoggy? You know, I'm gonna be honest with you, I have never seen somebody just whip the shit out of Peter throughout the entire level. Yeah, speedrun tic tac Darian. If I can whip him, why wouldn't I? Yippee! Can you at least kill my enemies too? Also, sheesh! Whee! Let's go! It's time! No, 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 stop it! I'm trying to walk my boy! No! He's addicted to meth now! Look at him! Stop! I- I shot you! I shot you! Now my fucking heroin addict of a son's gonna come back! No, stop it! Stop it! He's going to buy more heroin right now! No! Damn it! That counts? Why does the tentacle count? Is the tentacle drugs? Yep, you gotta protect Peter from anything and everything. Okay, am I getting checkpoints and just not knowing it? Yep. Oh, good. Because the game knows how frustrating this fucking level is. Damn it, Peter! Alright, I'm can, ready. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure you can shoot the tentacles, by the way. Yeah, it's just uh it's really fun to just make him jump over. And... This is all your fault, Peter. This is why your mom and I got divorced. This song the song for this level is very crash bandicoot esque. I could see it. Man, he really just chooses how far to send you back. Oh yeah! <laughs> it chooses. Best sun whipper this side of the west! Or the Mississippi! Bam! What? Okay, good. I guess he's just carrying my boy. Oh no! 
quickly, quickly, make ground, make ground. Oh my God, you little turd. Stop resisting! You've broken all of my limbs! Stop resisting! Why do the rest of your bones still resist my breaking them? Shit. No! Bad boy! Down! Damn it! He's gonna do it again! He's gonna do it again! You're just enabling my son! I'm pretty sure the spots Peter takes you to are actually the checkpoints. And fuck off, Peter! Oh, I didn't realize it was like that. Well, shit. Should I just having the having the extra live codes is great for this. You know what? Maybe I should just fuck. Yeah, honestly. I'm glad you were up front whenever you did this and you're like, oh, look, I'm gonna be real. There's no way you're getting this done in three lives. And at first I was like, oh, how hard could it be? And I'm like, oh my god, this game in this game is hell. No, no, bad man, don't do it. I meant to whip him, damn it. Instead, I shot him. Hate it when that happens. <laughs> and to think, this game was beaten as a child without these codes. I, I almost don't believe that, you know? Oh shit. Damn it. I did it again. Run, run from the dog. No. My son, he's very sick. He has a crippling drug addiction. Oh fuck, I just let that happen. Well, well, well. Oh, come on. He should have made that. So, you ready for a fun fact about this game? What? One of the programmers name is Andy Astor. Oh, he's Andy Asteroids. Mm-hmm. He was the one who programmed this level. Fuck Andy. Oh no! No! Don't make me do it all again! Oh, come on, man! What? Mm. This is why you beat your kids. That's all I'm saying. This is why. <laughs> Motherfucker ain't listening. He's. <laughs> that is so wrong in so many ways. Look, okay? If he fucking listened, maybe he wouldn't. Oh my god. Like, what's he doing? Why are we even here? Why are we on Meth Planet? Is this ever explained? Yeah, you crash landed here. Fuck. Nope, 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 stop it. No, please stop it. I hate that you just bring me back here every time. Yeah, you, have, you actually happen to crash land on your best friend's planet. This is my best friend? Yep. I don't believe it. Yep, it's canon that, uh, that Peter is one of Jim's best friends. Well, fuck you, Peter. What the? I didn't even. I didn't even do that. Man. 
Peter. All right, all right. I can do this. I can do this, even if Peter's a little bitch. That's what we gotta do. Fuck that gravity shit. Beat his ass. That is a picture I just posted. I'm, it's going to memes. That's so twisted. I love it. Man, all the way back. That's brutal. At least those enemies won't be there anymore. I muted my mic at some point. Oh, I muted my mic to sneeze. Oh, I forgot to unmute. Look at him just merrily skipping along, caring not about the dangers. Okay, good, we hit a fucking checkpoint. I don't know how much there's left of this level, honestly. It's fine. I'm fine. I, look, this lets me- this lets me get my aggression out. <laughs> I can't unhear the- I can't- I can't unhear the observation that it sounds like a Crash Bandicoot theme now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's- it really does sound a lot. It, it, it has Bandicootian vibes. Okay, we hit another checkpoint, that's good. Come on, Peter! You're wanted for crimes, Peter. Oh shit, I should have done this first. No, Peter! No! These are the crimes you're wanted for! Remember, you can always shoot at him to stop his momentum. Oh, you mean when he's not absolutely hulking out? Correct. Okay. Because he gets down if you shoot at him. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, hopefully this counts. Alright, come on now, Peter. Come on now, Peter. Damn it. I need to get pretty him sure. on there without having I'm to pretty, like I'm beat pretty his pretty ass sure off. No matter what angle you whip him at, Shit. he'll still go flying forward. Okay, that's the biggest thing because I was worried that if it was like fully all the way down, that he wouldn't fly the way I need him to. Also, I keep jumping on it at the wrong time. That doesn't help. No. God damn it. Oh yeah, you can also juggle him too if you get if you're good enough. To Shit, I fell. Damn it. I was hoping I could trigger another checkpoint before he got here. No, no, damn it. Again, just think of the frustration of having to do this without these codes as a kid. Yeah, no, are you kidding me? I know, I know the, the absolute state that, that websites were in when it came to, like, looking up help for games. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. I hate that falling is just instant death. Damn it, I should have shot. Parrying him up in the air is pretty fun, though. Yeah, 
Damn it. Okay. It's running time. No, stop it. Look, bro, you gotta quit the juice. You're not you whenever you're juicing. Damn it! Shit, I should have shot first. <clears throat> there was a hook. The hook had to be close. Oh, there he goes. I should have done that. Ooh. I just found something that makes me curious. What? Apparently a... Somebody, somebody has found and has perfectly remade Altoid Sours. Huh. Oh, so fucking good. I don't even think I ever had those. Damn it. I just saw Peter get down and then fall in the pit. <laughs> that was hilarious to watch. Shit. Yeah, I... I hate this little fucking bastard. I warn you. No, that was my best run! Oh my god. I would never have gotten rid of that fucking shuttle, or the UFO or whatever, but I- that was my best run so far. Oh, well. <laughs> the juggle into the pit. Yeah, sometimes my juggling isn't perfect, you know? Juggling in its own right is just hard. Mm. 
I always forget there's that second tentacle. It it pones me every fucking time. What? Oh, come on. Oh, what? I totally whipped him. That's so stupid. Alright, I can do this. I just have to get to my Texas roots. To the rootin', tootin', and shootin' part of my body. What? Okay. Like, like, seriously? Like, how come that didn't work? That one should've worked. No, oh, what the fuck? I think should have stayed down. All right, come on. Work with me! What, what was the dog's name? Oh, there's not gonna work with me. It's He's Pete. Dying. Pete. Fuck out of here, the Pete. That's why the level's called, for Pete's sake. Oh. Man, fuck you, Pete. Damn it. I just, you know what it is, next time I'm getting here, I'm just gonna fucking kill this goddamn thing. Okay, it's dead. Now I should be able to pass completely fine. No! Oh my god. Alright. Pete? I need you to work with me, Pete! I don't know how we're friends, but we're not going to be friends for much longer if you don't get your ass into gear. I called you my son. It was a mistake, but I did say it. Let's go! I saw the advanced sign and I was like, nerr. I don't think so. Nice job! Finish Groovy. for Pete's sake! Finally! Groovy. Groovy. I love how they gave you the ammo too on the way out. Yeah, that was nice. More Andy Asteroids? They really spoil me. Truly. Well, the, well it's the final Andy Asteroids. The last Andy Asteroids? Oh, this is gonna be fucking hard then. Oh shit. Oh no. I was gonna be cocky, but then I got two rocks in a row. It's over. You got rock and sock connection? I just got absolutely fu- oh, you know what? Hang on, hang on. He's here. He's here. We can- we can make it work. We can make it work. Alright, here we go. Sounds like he ran into a rock this time. Nope. Nope. He's still here. Come on. 
Whoa, Nelly. No, you bitch. You bitch. Well, the good news is if he wins, you can just skip it. Oh, I died. Straight up died. Okay. Well, at least I get to restart, I guess. He gets a lot I more of a... Uh, huh? I love how you ran into a rock right as you tried to hit one of the frigging... Boosts, yeah. Boosts. I don't know how that happened. Damn it. I need more shields. Having the shields definitely makes me like a more confident player when it comes to Andy Asteroids, so I need to start getting a lot more of them. The pain in the Andy Asteroids. Alright, there we go. And of course, now. I think Andy Astro was the one who actually programmed this one, too, obviously. I mean, he's Andy from Andy Asteroids. If he didn't program it, then who did? I swear, though, Tommy Tellerico did a great job with the soundtrack, though. He, oh, fuck, he's responsible? Oh, yep. my God, it's a trap that's literally like a fucking, it's on top of the rock on purpose. That's so fucked. It's over for me. He's going to win. Oh, it's like, oh, well, level skip. Oh, 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 unless I'm an absolute devious bitch and pull it off at the last second, let's go! Absolute fucking, absolute nice. degenerate behavior. Racing etiquette, zero. Points on my license, five. Ruby! Buttville. It's time for the final. I never thought I'd be here in scenic Buttville. By the way, Buttville is actually just Jim's name for this area. What do you. Oh, oh, that's just like a nickname? Well, remember what the final boss of this game is named. Uh, I. Did we ever talk about that? Uh, they give you the story beforehand and in the manual, but her name is Queen Slug for a Butt. That's funny. So, ergo, butt fill. Okay, let's see. And then we gotta do... Very weird that you don't get the the heal like that one's weird because i tried healing but it didn't seem to work so um i don't know if you saw the text before when you started it told you to use your head my head so how do you feel about propeller diving have we have we learned that nope you have to use your head as a propeller and gently float down good luck Oh, damn. Okay. I was doing pretty good at first. You were doing excellent for your first run through. Yeah, I was gonna say, for not doing that ever, I think I really fucking nailed that shit. So, yeah, you basically only get three strikes and you're dead. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Okay, going to the left is not the move. That passage was so narrow. Yeah, it's narrow, but there's, like, a lot of stuff along that path, like, three lives and junk. Oh, an extra life. Fuck, I shouldn't have gone for that. Why do I oh, care? Oh, I feel bad. Why? Um, funny enough, you were actually at the end of the descent before your first, when you're at your first death. 
That was it? That was the end? That was the end of the descent, was that last, like, tight pathway. Oh shit, okay, well I can get there, it's fine. Wait. So, this level is a two-parter. Wait, the tight path? Well, you can get there with the right or the left, right? Yeah, so the right path is generally the easier one, the left path just leads to a free life. Okay. You know what? Oh no, oh no, that- I was like, oh, I should try to go to the right, and then I changed my mind, and changing your mind is something you can't do in this. You don't have the- you don't have the life to change your mind. The left path is the easier of the two, by the way, heading down. The left? Yep, on the- on- yeah, on the- at the very bottom. The left path is the easier one. Oh, at the- oh, there. I thought you meant the actual left path. That's on me. <laughs> Misinterpreted lyrics, uh, dick cotton microwave. <laughs> Dick on <it> microwave. <laughs> this was way harder than I remember it. Shit, I try I should have just kept holding down. That's what I should have done. Alright, how many lives do I have? I'm probably gonna have to get more. Yeah, don't wanna run out here. Yippee! God, I love the track for the descent. No, come on, let me through! Oh, I hate that he quit- he just keeps bouncing on the sides when that happens. I don't know how to stop that once it starts. Oh! Oh my god, I did it! And now you're on part two. Of how many? Two? More? This section, this level split into three. The Descent, the Queen's Lair, and then the Queen. Oh, gotcha. That makes sense. Those spikes still do 40 damage, by the way, so try not to fall. Oh, jeez. Okay, I think these are more for show than anything. Am I supposed to somehow grapple up all of these? Oh yeah, swing back and forth. You have to quickly turn around and swing back and what forth. What the fuck? I'm only good at going down. How do I do that? Oh, 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 oh! Remember to. Damn. Here we go. Here we go. Damn. Okay, that hurt. There's a platform to your left you keep avoiding. Wait, that's a platform? Yep. Oh. Oh, that's nice. Is there any health here? Wait, no, why do I have all these... I have all these fucking blaster, uh... Oh, you have plasma oh, sh shots. There we go. Damn it! Stung by a bee and died. Sounds like typical gym style. So that pl so like there's not that platform is the way I'm supposed to go, right? Okay, I had to be sure, because this little tree makes it seem like there could be something off to the right, and I just don't know if I should care. Most of the stuff in Buttville is just a trap for the most part. Fucking Buttville, bro. 
It's fucking butt bill, dude. You don't even know. Farts? Stinky butt ass. Bill, dude. It's butt. I would very highly recommend you use the energy uh, cheat for this for this level. Okay. You know what Darian recommends? I'm I'm on board. Darian doesn't often recommend. That's the thing you gotta learn about Darian. You know what? No, you do recommend, but usually it's something that's like methods of completion, not like you're gonna you're gonna need all the help you can get. That's that's rare. You'll usually you'll let someone fail a couple times, and be like, it's hard, isn't it? Yeah, then no, this level sucks. Oh, what the fuck? Like, putting it bluntly, this level sucks. Okay, so I mean I guess it's Buttville. Is there like oh there is another hook? Yeah, that's why I said learning how to do whipping like that is gonna, was gonna be so necessary for this. Oh yeah, let me dig this one up just in case if you need it. You know, no reason in particular, you know. Oh, okay, I see. It might be one of the same types where, like, the light, the uh, energy refill, where it might not show it immediately. Yeah, but I thought energy refill did it after a second. No, it, it only does it when you take damage, by the looks of it. Nope. <laughs> well, there's your wall. Your ammo's going back up. It worked before. I don't know why it's not working now. Well, you were struggling a lot with that code. Right, and I got it to work. I don't want to touch something and die. Love how you just slowly move to your right and hope the best. Oh yeah, I forgot the little shits that come from the ground. Oh, there we- okay, so it did actually do that. That's weird, so I guess you do have to take damage, but it didn't do it the first time.
Oh, good, it continue. Okay, why? There's like nowhere for me to go from there. Let's see what's up. Um, I'm trying to remember how the map for this goes. Oh, there's a hook. Yeah, I was gonna say, I thought I saw a hook right there. I also, just, I thought like because it was hurting me, maybe I wasn't gonna make it out. Oh, don't forget about the, uh, the basketball looking things with platforms. Oh, really? Mm hmm. Okay, so that's what I was wondering. I didn't think they were at first. Okay, don't want to die there. Oh, you fall off of them. Okay. Yeah, they uh, they're slippery. Wow, I'm actually looking at the map for the place now. How bad is it? Um, you're getting pretty close. To the, you're getting pretty close to the mid boss. Oh Jesus! Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh no, I, I, I couldn't even get up. Yeah, I was just damage boosting myself to death. It sucks. Okay. Well, we got to the continue, and then now we got a hook. Jeez. And of course, I, I really just did that. When you get to the lineup of basketballs again, if you go to your left, there's another continue. Oh, okay. What? Oh, come on. As I say, I think you can shoot that from the ground. Uh, oh, that. Oh, shit. I say, oh, shit, like I'm not gonna be alright. <laughs> okay. Trying to give you all the tools necessary. No, I appreciate that. Because God, this level's annoying. Okay, I think I got it. Okay. <laughs> the adequately named Scenic Butt Bill. Hey, named by Jim himself. I thought his name was Doug. Oh, wait. Right. <laughs> Earthworm Jim. <laughs> I don't know why, I just immediately thought of the guy that made I just can't believe that the guy made Cat Scratch. I think that's why I'm just kind of fucked up about oh, it. Oh, you should see usually the point and click games he made. What point and click games did he make? Uh he made the Neverhood is uh He had did a game called The Neverhood, which was a point and click game, and then he made a sequel to that called Skull Monkeys, which is a platformer. Okay, I'm at the bunch of basketballs. You said to the left? So if so, the lowest most basketball. If you hang a, if the, if you if you hang a left through that little tiny the break right there, there is a continue there. Okay. The f oh my god, the bug cut me in half. That's fucked. Yep, that's insta death. I didn't realize it was like that. I guess I just avoided them all before. 
Okay. I don't think there's a real easy way to get in there down there, so, uh... If you want to just use the basketballs, I'd understand. Okay, so I'm on the uh, bottom basketball. It's like in that like spike crevasse. Yeah. I wonder how the hell you're supposed to get over that? Oh, wow! It really is just in here, isn't it? Okay, and then you just I guess you just keep going this way. Oh, it just brings you back. No wait, no, it doesn't. Oh, Jesus. Oh, right. Those things don't... I hate that the little clam things don't die. Or at least they don't seem to die. Yeah, the only way to really quote-unquote kill them is to, uh... Use the plasma... Use the plasma attack. See, now you can at least go to the right and get on the basketball to get up higher. I think if you damage boost, you can get up there, but... Yeah. Oh, oh, come on. I thought he was going to be done by the time I was there. Yeah, they're annoying. Fucking wall centipedes. Can't believe it. Yippee! Oh, Grandy got promoted to Sapphire League? That's Pog. Oh, there's a hook. Okay. I was like, how do you get out of here without taking damage? There's got to be a way. Oh, there is a hook. I didn't even see that. Ever vigilant, Caro. Known for my vigilance. No! Ever. Like I said, you're about midway through the level at this point. Okay. It's mid. Oh my goodness. No wonder. No wonder you're like, do whatever you want. Yeah. Now, there aren't that Shit. many of those instant death snippers after that point. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, there's only one last, like, corridor of them, and that's the end of it. Yippee! And just gotta yippee up, and then you're all ready. That's how this game goes. Oh, come on. I should've just jumped again. It was time. The cycle was right. I think you can actually kill yippee. the uh, those guys. Like, kill them how? Just shoot them. You think so? Yeah, when they pop out, I'm pretty sure a few a few couple shot, a few dozen shots will kill them. I think the problem is that I don't know if you can shoot while sliding off these things. You have a little bit of time to shoot at them, so. Damn. Okay, I think I'm just, I think part of me is just nervous about shooting while I'm sliding off. I think it's just an easy way to fall. Oh, what the fuck? Ah, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, I didn't mean to damage boost like that. I don't know if I can hit them from there. Nope. Get me up there. No! So it's better to try shooting them than to just die in a single hit. Yeah, I think the main thing is that they don't they don't take like he's not being hit.
like I'll try to just stand on the platform and aim up from underneath him, but he's not he's not recoiling when I shoot at him. Yeah, they don't. I think it's just a waste of ammo. Like Oh, it should be hitting. Should be hitting him. I don't know why it's not. What? I totally just did the health thing. That sucks. I sent you a little something. I was gonna hold that one off, but desperate times, desperate measures. <laughs> what? Hold one off? What do you mean? Oh. Um. Maybe? I'm only saying maybe because I don't know if that'll hit him. I also don't know if I can I'm... fire that diagonally, can I? You can. Okay. And I guess it's worth a shot. Let's see. Literally. You know it's powerful because it uses the bumpers. Is it one of the ones that you just don't know that it's making a sound? I think so. Just aim at the dude and hope for the best. <laughs> yeah, it was it. Okay, fuck. Now I gotta do it again. Uh. You have eight shots, by the way. Wait, oh, once you do that, you get eight? Is that how it works? Yep. You get nine shots total, I think, which is the cap. Oh, shit. You have all the tools. Yep, I definitely got it. That's funny. Shit. No. No, stop. Jim, please. It won't, it won't do the damn diagonal input whenever I want it to. I hate that. It's, yeah, it's hard to aim diagonally with that. I think that got no it didn't get him damn it Oh, come on! I didn't want to climb up on that gym. Read the room, buddy. That sucks. Yippee! 
I mean, worst comes to worst, you can just damage boost up the side and try to get on the platform. <laughs> you know what's funny? That was my plan A before you told me that I could shoot them. <laughs> Damn it, I hate that I can't just nail this fucking right shot. Oh, I can't even do it. It's not diagonal enough. But trust me when I say, um, I would try damage boosting. That's just me. Jesus fuck. Is that a platform to my left? I can't tell. I don't want to jump don't on it. Don't worry about it, just head right. Just don't go don't right. even worry about it, he says. Just go right. Oh my god, no. Oh, you missed the whip. Oh. Is that what that is? Yeah, there was a there was a hook up there you could you would need to grab onto. I didn't see. I think he's dead, Jim. No. Yeah, they don't. I'll tell him when he's dead, Jim. I think you can damage boost left. I'm not a hundred percent sure. Yep, nope. Nothing you can do here except die. You know what I can do, Darian? My damn best. Oh damn it, that's the end. Yeah, okay. I couldn't I couldn't couldn't keep it going past that. So when you damage boost your way back up there, you have a hanging ceiling you can get onto, then you have to whip. Damn it. I didn't mean to do it like that. I bet you I could just get on that one basketball and then damage boost up that way. Oh, couldn't do it in time. Yippee! Well, at least you have your strategy for getting up there. Today's stream is brought to you by the sound. <laughs> Honestly. The 27th letter of the alphabet. Ow. 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 
No, fuck, I was safe. Wait, when you jump to your right, there's a hanging ceiling you'll end up on. And that's where you and right after that, there's a hook, Bill. You'll see it glow. I think I might have seen the hook just now, but I think I fell past it. Yep, I'm next to the... I think I'm next to the thing I was before. Oh, what the oh, hell? you are. My damage boost didn't go off. Yeah, once you fall there, you can't really do anything but die. That sucks. Don't forget about your lives. Yippee! 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 Yippee indeed. Looks like we got ourselves a yippee off. How am I supposed to whip from being damage boosted like that? Well, you get on. Well, you get on the platform and then you grab the hanging ceiling I was telling you about, and you drop down into the whip. So where's the? I see spikes and spikes. Where's the platform in this situation? The basketball back there. Way back there? Yeah. Because remember, there's a hanging ceiling. You have to jump onto the ceiling and hang from it. Okay. Okay. So let me go back then. Yeah, you can see, like, the foliage hanging from the ceiling. That's how you know you're in the right spot. Gotcha. Oh shit, I got- Nope. Okay. And then I have to drop and do that? Yep, you have to drop and whip. Let's go! Continue! Oh, thank goodness I never thought I'd be so happy to see you! All right, now we're getting now we're right. getting places. Now I'm gonna test this fucking bullet theory. We got a low worm right here. Yeah, so yeah, I should have been hitting him. What the fuck? Oh god damn it! Well, at least I just got to continue. I couldn't see if he was dead yet. Oh, they, you'll know when they die. They explode. Oh, they do? Yeah. Okay, that's an eight. I thought that said three at first. Yippee! You know what's funny is that continue isn't on the map I'm seeing, so that must be something they added, something that was added to either this game or the... Or it wasn't in the Genesis version, which, God, that's horrible. Which, by the way, you can also damage this path this area if you wanted to. Hmm. You literally just keep heading right and you'll end up damage boosting past the area. You had me at IOW! I had you at IOW! Okay, let's see, do I have to go back? No, you said to the right, so... Yep. Right, drop down. Oh, what the shit? Oh, is this the boss? That's the mini-boss. Oh, mini-boss. Yep, so shoot at it, and then just keep moving right. Oh, 
Uh, say hello to J. Alfred Maggot. Is that really his name? That is really his name. And he's the ovipositor. Oh, he's a butthole. Well, yeah. sort of. Again, uh, they expected kids to be able to beat this. Again, they expected kids to beat this, by the way. Yeah, I just, I can't believe that they ever did. Don't forget about the ammunition code if you need it. You know, I never thought I was gonna until this exact moment. <laughs> Oh, there you go. You have to shoot for the ammo refill. Jesus Christ. I can imagine a lot of kids failed that part, huh? Mm-hmm. Yippee! There should be a continue, and you're down to the final section. Hooray! By the way, did you notice the cow when you were going through the level? The cow? No. What cow? Uh, remember the cow that you launched in New Junk City? It's here? It, yeah, you'll see it flying through the background. Oh my god, that's so funny. Oh shit, I guess my damage boost didn't work. This last level, Jesus Christ, it almost feels like they had initially set this up to be an arcade game. At least you at least you beat the final mid boss of the game and now you're down to the final area and final boss of the game. This is also where Jim meets his second best friend. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, good. So you see the little platform that's flying around? Uh, yeah, I didn't know it was a platform, though. That's, that's snot. It's snot? Yeah, like I said, Jim's second best friend. I didn't realize it was like that. But now you know what to do, so use those green platforms to your advantage and take the bitch down. Oh, come on! Oh, come the fuck on! I hate that! I was trying to do the... I was trying to do the helicopter thing, and it didn't... 
it didn't do what I wanted it to do. I still feel like I should be taking apart this controller at some point. <laughs> Goodness knows, I mean, like, you know, between it being Milo's childhood controller and Milo, Milo's mom being like a chronic smoker, I just want to know what the inside of this thing looks like. Thanks, booger guy. So are we, we're just going to the left for this, right? Yep. Okay. You're going to go to the, uh, the next the next snot platform you're going to. Oh, shit. God damn it. At least there's a way up from the spike this time. Oh my... I, it didn't even let me pause in time to save myself. Like, I, I was hitting the pause button, and I, I guess I just wasn't hitting it hard enough. That's ass. This thing, this is your last push. Once this is done, that's it. Game's over. I know! I, I'm still kind of unclear as to what our objective is. Because, like, we just kind of arrived in New Junk City. They didn't really explain a whole lot. Yippee! Like, do, why do we have a, a beef? We're just kind of here. Typical sp just right. space exploration kind of stuff. You're just trying to rescue the princess. Mm. So, the real story behind the game is, is that the super suit that Jim is wearing was initially meant for the queen here. Yippee! But Jim found it and then is going after Princess What's-Her-Name. So where does the right go? Yippee! Nowhere. It's just health. No, you just went back upstairs. Oh. And you can't get back down unless you... Uh... Ooh, I almost made it. Okay, we're good. We're good. It's all good. Mm -hmm. Like I said, once you get on that second stop platform, you're basically home free. So what? where's the, what do I leave from this? Do I leave down? Oh my God, wait, that killed me already? So where do I leave from the second snot platform? You, you don't, you have to kill the boss. That's the boss? Oh, I didn't realize. I like, I just thought it was just a, a, new, a new enemy. Didn't really have boss energy compared to some of the stuff we'd seen. Okay. I didn't think it was like that. Yeah. Yippee! Shoot the shit out of her. Oh no. What the hell? What's going on? Did you see that? Yippee! Darian, did you see that? Yeah, she hit you with her scepter attack because and and you went out of the map. So. That that's what happens? Yep. Oh. Yeah, that's why you have to continuously interrupt her. That scepter attack is an instant kill. Jesus, okay.
I think you can also stock up on ammo before you get to her, too. Let's see. Huh, how do I keep fucking this up? I don't know. Maybe... What's the max ammo you can have? 1500, right? I think so. That's weird. Oh shit, I fucked up. And I saw like a blank one. Like, why did she jump? I didn't jump. Not on purpose anyways. Plasma blasting. I wasn't gonna let her get one over on me again. I thought I managed to glitch the game and get into the game over screen whenever that uh, first happened. Oh, let's go. Damn, if I had to use all those shots to get her to do like that, you're the best. That's true. But also, that's, the game. that's crazy. So, fucking Pog, first of all. But second of all, could you imagine how many hits does it take without the fucking, uh, the Gat Blaster? What the fuck? Yeah, uh, the whip actually does, uh, actually does oh. a little damage to her. Okay, I, I see why so he saved her, though. <laughs> is she an Earthworm, too? Like, is that what's going on? No. She's a bee. Oh. Shit, okay. There's definitely porn of her. The cow! <laughs> She's beautiful! A hotel of dick sucking And that is the exact Jesus same Christ. cow you launched in New Junk City. I love that. That's awesome. Uh, I'm just glad we got to- I'm just glad we got to do that in a- in a timely manner by the end of the, the month. program, Andy Astroids. Andy- Andy from Andy Asteroids? Doug Tanoffel. Congrats on beating the game. Thanks, love. Just in time for the month to be over. Honestly, I think that's one of those things I would have been a little bit more stringent about uh, using codes and stuff if I wasn't, like, not only trying to beat it by the end of the month, but also Darian's like, trust me, you'll need these. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, okay, I feel less bad about it now. Oh no, there, there she goes. Princess is dead. No sequel. Everyone, the sequel's canceled. Pack it up. Good job, Carol. Thank you, Scott. Look at the cow's face. She's the real queen to me. You almost had S rank on Ides of March. We have an unauthorized use of force. Was it Vex? What the fuck? Is that all the people that made the game in, in gym? That has to be. Yep. That's cool. It's creepy, but cool.